Hey guys, what's up? This week I decided I'm going to be filming a weekly vlog. I usually only do daily vlogs and I decided um, I'm just going to do a weekly vlog. So I'm just going to be filming a little bit of each day and what I do throughout the week. So today is Wednesday. No, it's not Wednesday. It's it's Monday, unfortunately. Um, it's 6.30 in the morning, so that's why this lighting is like god-awful. But I'm just getting ready for the salon. I have a full day of clients today, so I'll usually um, in there from like anywhere from 11 to 13 hours um, on the days that I do go into the salon, which are just Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in. My first client starts at 8.30, um, and then I'm usually out of there by like 8.30, 9-ish. I'm expecting I'll be out of there by 8.30, but we shall see. Um, so yeah, right now I'm just finishing my makeup. I'm gonna put on my mascara. This is my favorite one. This is by Hourglass right here. It's so good. That is basically what I'm doing today, just going to the salon. So if you guys wanna follow me along for the rest of the week, then let's get started. So I'm leaving for work, and as you guys can see, I do have my dogs with me. I'm, I don't take them to the salon, um, but I do take them to daycare on the days that I go to work just because they are such long hours. So I try and make sure that they're really nice and exercised. I take them to a facility. If you guys are in Charlotte, definitely like DM me on Instagram or something. And I'll let you guys know if you're interested, but they go to a facility. I'm going to put this down. Um, a facility where I think it's 26,000 square feet is their backyard. Um and they just play all day long. So literally be outside for 12 hours straight and there's always like, I think like 50 dogs there for daycare all the time and Brutus and Tank are regulars there. So they have their like best friends. Brutus has a Rottweiler friend, which is so cute. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and go drop them off at daycare. I'm a literal mom. I'm, I work so I can take my kids to daycare. That's about it. Um, okay, that's fine. Mm. Brutus literally stays like this the whole time that I'm driving, just so you guys know. Just so you guys know. And little tank over there. I don't know if anybody else's German Shepherd is super vocal when they're excited, but like he knows that where he's about to go and it's so cute. And they wait by the door every Monday, Wednesday, Friday so they can go to daycare and it's just the cutest thing. You guys are about to hear. I'm not gonna put the camera up, but I'll just put the camera down and you guys can hear like how crazy he gets. So it's five o'clock and I'm obviously not at the salon anymore. I got a really bad headache in the middle of my day and I don't really give myself time to eat. That sounds so bad, but time is money and I don't feel like wasting my time. So you guys are hairstylists, you will totally understand when you have a busy day, which that is my day every single day. So I don't give myself time to eat. And what I'm getting to is that I took some headache medicine. I think it was extra strength Excedrin and I vomited and I felt nauseous and my whole body got really hot and really cold. And I still feel so sick that like my hands were like shaking like this when I was with my client because my whole body was just like shutting down literally it was so weak and my client was like you should probably sit down so I sat down in the middle of doing her hair and just gave myself like a couple minutes and it took everything in me to finish her hair just now so I grabbed myself some Panera soup and I'm currently on my way home because I need to go to sleep and I need to feed myself and I feel so bad because I canceled my last client but when I canceled her I was like I'm so so sorry like I don't ever do this and she was like oh my god I'm so sick right now I didn't want to cancel on you so that actually worked perfectly and now I'm gonna go home and sleep and probably vomit some more god this is so bad I need to like not do this to myself <laughs> Look how patient Brutus is. Are you hungry? You want to eat? <laughs> hey, Tanky. Hey, good morning. Happy Tuesday. I came back from the dead. I feel so much better. I didn't start feeling better until like I was actually going to sleep last night. So it was like 9.30 and I was just, I was a mess. 
last night. I was such a mess. So I feel much, much better after some rest and some good water and fluids and food and all that stuff. So I just wanted to show you guys some vitamins that I'm taking this morning. This is the women's energy metabolism and bone support. I just take this. It's like a women's one a day. Um, my hair, skin, and nail gummies. I like these. These are really inexpensive for biotin if you're looking for some. Don't go spending your money on like $40 bottle of vitamins for a month. It's just these do the job. And then I'm also taking my probiotics. This is from the brand Floor Store. I probably won't buy this brand again. It was super expensive. It works really well, but like I said, super expensive. Um, I think this bottle right here was like 60 something dollars normally, like 70 something. So that's insane. And then I just have my trusty dusty jug of water. This was like 17 to $20 on Amazon and it's dishwasher safe and everything. So I love it. It comes in a bunch of different colors. This is from the brand So Cool. If you guys can see it right there. Um, but yeah, I love this. It definitely holds me accountable for drinking water. If it tells you anything, I usually drink one to like one and a half of these per day. Um, and yesterday, by the time I got out of work at five, so 10 hours, no, that was like 11 hours after I woke up, I'd only drink in this much water. So I was like about to pass out. Um, but yeah, and then I just have some coffee that I'm going to drink while I edit. I have to edit and then I'll get my camera and everything set up so I can film it, get ready with me. I'm gonna go see a chiropractor today. I'm super excited. She's so awesome. I found her on Instagram. Um, she's pretty well known here in Charlotte. So I'm gonna go see her. Um, I'll put everything you know, down below if you guys are interested and I'll show you guys her office. It's so cute, I'm so excited. So I'm gonna go see a chiropractor. As you guys know, like my 13 hour days, I'm on my feet all day long, so. My back is probably pretty messed up. Um, but yeah, that's what I have planned so far for today. Um, probably gonna go to the gym later. Um, I don't think I have any errands to run really that much, so. Tinky, you got your toy? Come on. What are you doing, Brutus? Ten bucks says you can't catch this tanky. Close. Come on. I wanted to show you guys, Christian and I built this little succulent garden a couple weeks ago. It was on Easter weekend. Um, so yeah, these are the little succulents that I got. This one right here is doing so good. It's so cute. I love it. And this one's like a little weirdo, but I felt bad for him, so I picked him up. But look how cute he is. Yeah, I just found a little get ready with me type of video, and this is like my everyday look that I do without lashes. So I'm going to go ahead and straighten out some of my hair because I have like little kinks in it and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and straighten that out and then I'm gonna go run my errands and go see my chiropractor. If you guys are curious, I'm using the Caviar Perfect Iron Spray. This is the heat protectant that I really, really like. And then this is the Amiga Straightener. I'm review on their deep waiver thing. If you guys haven't seen in the past video, it's so amazing. I was obsessed with it. So now I'm just using their straightener. I've used this a couple times now and I really, really like it. I don't know how it does for super like coarse or thick hair because obviously my hair is super fine and straight already. So it's really not that much that has to be done. Um, but I do really like it. So I just needed one for my own personal use and yeah.
I may or may not have the prettiest chiropractor in the world. Seriously, guys. I'm going to leave her little Instagram handle down below if you guys want to check it out. But she, A, is so freaking pretty. I'm like, okay, I'm going to go put a paper bag over my head. But two, my body feels so good right now. Like, I have so much shoulder pain and neck pain because I'm always like this with my clients all the time. Um, and so, like, oh, she adjusted me so good. I've never been to a chiropractor. But I was like, when can I come back? because I want to come like every week now. <laughs> I'm like kind of obsessed with it. So um, yeah, if you guys are in Charlotte, definitely check her out. Her name is Dr. Laura Peterson and she's amazing and she's so knowledgeable too. So Christian and I are actually celebrating our three year tomorrow and we have been dating for longer than three years. Like I'm sure you guys have seen him around for a lot longer. Um, but the first year I don't really count it just because he was still in college in a fraternity and I was living with my girly friends and you know we weren't taking life too seriously which means we weren't taking each other too seriously um so yeah it's been officially three years since we've been like together we've been a thing um but what i was going to get to is that i'm going to costco because we decided not to buy each other presents but i still feel like he's going to take me out to dinner and all this stuff and i want to get him at least something and something that we both have been wanting is a speaker for our house which is so random but like a music speaker so I'm going to go to Costco because I have a really good deal on one. So I'm going to go check it out, see how much it is, and then probably pick it up and get a card and stuff. I just made myself a salad for a late lunch slash pre-dinner. It's like five, almost five o'clock. So I guess it could be dinner, but this is definitely not dinner. I'm hungry. So I'm just eating this until Christian gets home. He's coming home a little bit, but this is more of like an Asian type of salad. I got this new dressing that I'm trying out. So yeah, I'm just gonna eat this while I edit some videos, do a little bit of work on my computer. Um, I got some emails to get back to. And then I think Christian and I might take the dogs for a W-A-L-K. Can't say that, can't say that word. Um, so yeah, we're gonna take them, probably either do that or go to the gym. We haven't decided yet, depends when he gets home. So see you guys later. This is a really long Tuesday, like really, really long Tuesday. And I'm so sorry. I don't know how long this weekly vlog thing is gonna do. Christian is home from work and we're just taking the little pups on a walk. I am trying this new thing on Brutus. It's called a gentle lead. <laughs> he's a little crazy about cars. Uh-oh. All right, he's a little crazy about cars and stuff. So this basically goes around his mouth and you're supposed to control his face. So that's what I'm trying out now. He doesn't like it. What you doing? No photos. No photos, please. No photos, please. No photos. For you, his uh. Good morning, happy Wednesday. I just realized I don't know if I'm wearing the same sleepy time shirt as I did yesterday, but. Oops, um, so I'm going to get started on breakfast. I'm going into the salon today. So I usually like to do just some rolled oats right here. This is from Aldi, I believe. And then I got some almond milk because I'm trying to cut out as much dairy as I can. Um, so yeah, I just mix that, put that in the microwave for about a minute and a half. And then once that comes out, I put um, this, this chocolate protein powder right here. This is from GNC, it's pretty good. Um, so I put about half a scoop in there and then I put some peanut butter in there as well. And then I go in with a banana and it's super, super good, high in protein and good in carbs. So that's how I'm gonna start my day today. I'm gonna go ahead and get ready and then I'll see you guys once I'm ready because it's a really hectic morning to get the boys ready for daycare. <laughs> oh man, I'm like a liberal mother. Okay, bye guys. Who's ready for daycare? Tanky, are you are you guys are you guys ready for daycare? Are you guys ready for daycare? For daycare? Who wants to go? Okay, alright. Hello. Oh, big yawn. Someone's sleepy. Clock. So it is almost eight o'clock and I am done for the day. I've been here since about eight, so almost 12 hours now. Um, it was cut a little bit shorter because one of my clients could come a little bit earlier, so that was cool. 
Um, and now Christian and I are going out to sushi, one of my favorite sushi places. You guys have probably seen it, Mr. Tokyo. Um, but I just like begged him to go. Normally, he doesn't really want to go to sushi, and we're going somewhere really nice for our anniversary this weekend. But I told him that I would just take us out to dinner um, today if he would take us out this weekend. So. Yeah, we're gonna go get some sushi, and I guess we'll see you guys tomorrow, because there's not really much much to do from now on, so I'll see you guys in the morning. It is six in the morning, and I am awake. Christian just left, and I don't know why Brutus is just sitting there. Like, he's being so weird. Why are you doing that? Why are you acting like that? He's acting so depressed. I don't understand. I don't know. I tried to like take him out and he just wasn't having it. But it's starting to get light out. Brutus, what's the deal, dude? Why are you so grumpy all the time? Anyways, what... Oh, that's zoomed in. Okay. Anyways, what we have on the agenda today, since it is Thursday and I'm not going to work... Um, I'm gonna set this down again because that's how I start every morning. <coughs> We're gonna go to the gym, okay? Because we haven't gone to the gym in a couple days, as you guys can probably tell. You're like, Frida, what? What's going on? Um, and the thing is, I go to the gym on Saturdays and Sundays, and then I just try and make it whenever I can, but I eat healthy throughout the week. So if I can make it, great. But my three days that I work in the salon are long and hard and and it's, it's rough. I don't want to go to the gym after I've been on my feet for that long. So Monday, I was obviously sick, so I didn't go. Tuesday, I was just super, super busy, and I was kind of waiting for Christian whether he wanted to go or not, and then we just walked with the, can't say that, W-A-L-K, the dogs. Um, and so today's Thursday, and we're going to go to the gym. We're, we're going to make it there. Um, and then I actually have a super exciting video I want to film. I found the wet and wild palettes like the ones that i found the other day but i found the purple one and i've been looking through some comments on wet and wild and people have said that they haven't seen a tutorial on it or haven't been able to find many tutorials so i think i'm gonna try and film uh, actually no i don't have a full face of wet and wild maybe i could do a full face of wet and wild because i have the lips i have Maybe like kind of a full face of wet and wild. I don't know. Something like that or just something with the palette. But yeah, so I want to pick up that one in the Nude Awakening palette. So I'm just going to collect all of them today. Before I leave for the gym, I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing. So I really, really like these pants. Um, these are from the brand Bombshell and they just basically look like really high socks. And then they have like a design or just a plain color. I have two of these. I have the gray camo and these green camo ones, but they're super, super flattering. I love them so much. They're super high-waisted, so that's really, really awesome. Um, and then these, um, this top right here is from the brand Joyride, I believe it's called, or Joy something from Target. So it's their workout line, but it just like cuts down here. Um, and I love it so much. It's so cute. And then I just have like a little Victoria's Secret sports bra underneath. So yeah, that is what I'm wearing. I'm going to go do leg day today. Um, and yeah. See you guys later. I'm back from the gym and I'm just sitting on my office floor. So I have something super exciting to show you guys. You know how I was going to go to the drugstore to go get the eyeshadow palettes from um, Wet n Wild. Well, I saw that they released a new collection. It's like their crystal collection. So obviously I did pick up the nude awakening palette, which just looks like this. I'm super excited. And then I also got this one that I showed you guys. I was really excited to get because not a lot of people have talked about it. So I think I want to film a makeup tutorial on this one right here. But while I was there, I also found um, they just released this new crystal collection. And the CVS that I usually go to always has like new releases like like really really quickly so i was really excited when i walked in they just were putting up the display and i took one of the two like sets that they had so um i only got a couple of things i got the wet n wild mega glow brightening rocks right here so these are supposed to be really blinding i saw them on like tati's 
um, YouTube channel. And then I also got this one right here, this highlighter, because everybody knows what wild highlighters are so good. I talk about them all the time. Um, and then I got these two trios right here. So I got the green one. Um, and then I also got this pinky one right here. So I was super excited. And then I also picked up the Mega Glow. Oh God, what is this? Uh, Mega Glow Face Mist. I was super excited to try that out. Okay, so I think I'm gonna film two different videos. I'm gonna do like this crystal collection in one video today. And then I'm also gonna film just a tutorial with this eyeshadow palette. So like a really quick tutorial with that. So it's pretty much lunchtime. It's almost 12 o'clock. So I'm going to go ahead and get started on a couple of things I have to do. I'm gonna do some of Christian's laundry because he has so much laundry. So I'm gonna help him out with that since he's working all day. Um, and then I'm gonna make myself some brunch. It's not really brunch time, but I need some food. So probably gonna make some avocado toast and some eggs or something like that. Sounds really good. I'll probably do that. Yeah. I'm gonna eat dinner and I'm actually eating my meal prep for dinner, which is what I normally do. But I wanted to show you guys something. So this is my pasta that I'm eating and the pasta that I ate, I just found this last week and I'm obsessed with it. This is the Bonza, Rotini, Bonza Rotini made from chickpea. So it's basically pasta made from chickpeas and it's really, really good. So it has 3.5 grams of fat, 32 grams of carbs, and 14 grams of protein. Um, or you could do the double serving or whatever, which is 56 grams of carbs and 25 grams of protein. So that's pretty good, even if you just want to eat the pasta by itself. Of course, I have my ground turkey in here with my pasta sauce. I wanted to show you guys this in case you guys are vegan or vegetarian. And then later on, it's kind of early. It's like six o'clock. So it's a little bit earlier for me to eat dinner. I usually eat at like eight, but I'm hungry. So this is what my protein shake consists of that I drink probably once a day. Sometimes I forget, but this is my favorite protein powder ever. It's in the flavor fruity cereal. And when I say it tastes like your Fruit Loop milk leftovers, it literally tastes just like that. You cannot taste that there are 25 grams of protein and it's two grams of carbs and zero grams of fat, 110 calories. This is so good. I'm obsessed with it. I have like two other backup containers for Christian and I because we're almost out of this one. But I want to show you guys those two things because I know you normally like when I give like health tips and stuff. I don't know why I'm not a nutritionist. I'm not a personal trainer. I just I just dabble in the fitness industry. Okay, um, I'm going to go eat. Bye. Boys to daycare and go to work. And I'll probably be there until... I think seven o'clock at the latest today. So it's a pretty good Friday. I'm not getting out at eight o'clock like I usually do. This isn't really a good week to represent what I normally do on like a Monday, Wednesday, Friday, because I promise I'm usually there a lot later than I have been this week. It's just one of my clients came early on Wednesday. Monday I was vomiting and now I just have an earlier day. So I'll be off by like seven, but I am going in at eight. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you. You ready for daycare? Yes, and Mr. Grumpy Pants over here, are you ready for daycare? Good morning, YouTube. I'm ready for daycare. Does anyone think I look different right now? Because if so, it's because I didn't put highlighter on. Like, none. Not even a smidge. I didn't even put blush on, you guys. I, I just, I don't, I don't know what to think of myself. I don't know. I don't. I don't know what to do with myself today. <laughs> I don't, I'm so sad. You guys are curious why I take the dogs to daycare. Look how pooped they are. They're literally laying in the back seat together. They each weigh a hundred pounds, and they're laying back there. Like they are so tired. And if you guys are wondering why I'm off work, my last client canceled, which. That's okay, because it's Friday, and it's Friday afternoon, and I'm not mad about it. Mm, bye. Dude, go away. I'm gonna go feed these babies dinner, and I'm probably gonna clean. Christian and I are going to the gym in a little bit when he gets home. That's something to my eyeball. Okay, see you guys later, or it might be, maybe I'll end the vlog here. If this is it, ta-ta for now.